This is Rob Mitchell of BloodHorse.com. I'm here today at 1080 Park with trainer Mark Cassie. Mark is still seeking his first Breeders' Cup win, and he's got five good chances this year. Uh, first of all, Mark, just tell us, you got some good two-year-olds. Tell us what, what they're doing and how they're coming into the Breeders' Cup. Well, I have Spring Venture. She's undefeated, um, winner of the Natalma. She's in the turf. She's trained really well from getting out here, and uh, quite happy with her. We have Dynamic Sky. He's in the Juvenile and on the dirt. It's his first try on the dirt. He ran a really good second in the Breeders' Fraternity last time at Keeneland. Um, we have Spring in the Air. She won the, the uh, Alcibiades last time, and um, she's training well. It's going to be her first try on the dirt. And certainly you got Delegation. Delegation. He's another that, you know, is going to be making his first start on dirt, but he's trained well. He, I'd like to see him quiet, a little quiet down. He's a little, little ambitious right now and a little wound up, but hopefully next couple of days he'll, he'll calm down a little bit. And then we've got Pool Play, the old veteran. I'm going to go for the $5 million in the Classic. Now, Pool Play, uh, tell us a little bit about He's had a very, uh, I guess, diverse career. He missed a lot of time due to an injury, and uh, you and uh, owner Bill Ferris were very patient with him. He has. You know, he, he started out as he never ran a two. He cracked his hind pasture and has some screws in there. And then he ran, um, he won the Stephen Foster as, I guess, a six-year-old last year. And right afterwards, he had a tendon injury. And he's come back, and he won the Hawthorne uh, Gold Cup in his last start. So it's it's he's kind of had some ups and downs. I'm, I'm quite proud of the old warrior, though. Uh, certainly, again, a lot of horses don't come back from tendon injuries. Uh, you know, particularly because it takes so long to get them back. A tendency to want to go ahead and retire them. Uh, why did you guys decide to keep him in training? Well, you know, Bill Ferris just he loves racing, and I mean, how how many times do you get the opportunity to have a horse like Pool Play and and I told him I thought we could get him back, and uh, he supported that decision, and that's why we're here today. And certainly, I mean, how, is this a really ambitious task you're asking this horse? I don't think so. I mean, he's ran twice on dirt. He's a grade one and a grade two winner. Let's show, show me anybody else that has that good a record on dirt. Okay. And what are you going to do from now on, between now and the end of the week? Uh, a lot of praying. No. Uh, just gallop. He's just going to gallop. Okay. Looked very good this morning. Oh, thank you. Thank you and good luck. Thank